Hey, Mouth 43 I had a question coming out of chapter 4, number 86. And this is a continuation of 84 and 85, so you can take a look at those videos. But by the time we get to 76, it says, on average, for every 25 patients calling in, how many do you expect to have the flu? So we hear that word expect, right? And that is, this, well, a lot of times we hear expected value, right? So sometimes you'll hear it as expected value. But when you hear that phrase expect, that's a buzzword for get me the average or get me the mean, those three vocab terms mean the same thing. And if you remember in 84, we had a binomial probability. And so if I have a binomial probability, I'll just scooch down here. I, I put my, my table here. If, I, if I'm in this binomial column and I want the mean, I just have to do n times p. That's the, the rule for this. So let me head back up here and let's quite literally just do n times p, keeping in mind my n is 25. And my P, my probability of success, meaning that somebody has the flu, is 4%. So when I do 25 times 0.04, I get 1. And this is the number of patients that have the flu. So what that's saying is if you have 25 patients, on average, you're going to expect one of them to have the flu. All right. And there's 86. Thanks so much. Bye.